images that came to define a legend. Album covers of the Nigerian musician Fela Kuti, who died in 1997. The artist who produced them, Lemi Gariokwu, is not such a familiar name, and yet he too is part of the Fela Kuti story. Fela was a thought provoker, and Lemmy was always able to translate that thought provoking um, theme that Fela represented in his music to visual art. So they were perfect pairs. Fela's, uh, Fela's mission and his um, advocacy was musical, where Lemmy's was visual. Throughout his 40 year career, Lemmy has produced a huge array of contemporary art, including more than 2,000 album covers but it was his years with Fela which made his name. Uh, the body of works um, of album covers that I designed for the music career of Fela and Nicolas Bokuti, the Afrobeat legend. Um, I had designed um, most of his album covers. Uh, specifically, I designed 26 of his album covers in his, in, you know, for his uh, musical career, uh, spanning three decades, the 70s, 80s and part of the 90s. Lemmy's works have been exhibited in New York and Paris, but he still works in Lagos, where he has a studio and also curates a museum dedicated to, who else, Fela Kuti. The Kuti family, they invited me and they said, uh, you know, uh, no one else uh, would do better to be the curator of the museum. So I, I received that <laughs> a challenge very gladly. The museum's based in Calakuta, the Lagos house where Lemmy lived as part of Fela's entourage, which also included his 27 wives and his children. It's now a magnet for fans and a fitting tribute from the man who helped define Fela Kuti's visual style.